So today I'm going to transform my plain notebook into something a little bit more special. So I had this idea of transforming the cover of my notebook. This is one of the notebooks um, that you pick up from Michael's, one of the very basic ones. So I use this for notes, inspiration and things like that. Uh, but I wanted to transform the cover because it's not very inspiring on the outside. I love the color. I love kind of like this pleather um, cover here. And these notebooks again are from uh, Michael's. You can always find them on like buy one, get one half off sale they're always on sale and they have like it's like a bullet journal so i do like it i think it's very practical um but yeah so i wanted to transform it make it more inspirational so i have these stamps that i selected from my stash and i think i'm gonna use the hello either the hello there or today makes me smile um something cute um, and then I have these cute little butterflies and birds um, and keys and all these little things that I want to put <laughs> here on the cover. And I'm going to use the embossing powder on gold. Uh, you're going to need some Versamark. And I'm going to also be using my embossing heating tool. And you can see it has been loved <laughs> a lot. Um, I had that for years. And so I'm also going to be using a plain sheet of paper to collect all the extra dust from the powder. So I'm going to start by stamping here on the cover, um, the, how I kind of want this to look. And let's see how this turns out. So I went ahead and stamped using the Versamark. So the Versamark is this uh, clear sticky ink. You probably won't see it um, in the video, but you'll see it if you are doing the technique. And then you can just go ahead and sprinkle your gold right on top. Okay, so I went ahead and cleaned the extra around it. And I just actually want the part that says today and before i put on my heat tool i'm just going to use the white paper to return the embossing powder back in place and then we're just going to go ahead and heat this up and i'm not going to go too close so i don't ruin the leather but you want to let the gold melt so you see how that is already coming together so there you go look how cute that looks it just makes such a difference you don't want to touch it yet just let it cool off for a little bit and what i'm going to do now is just select some of these images and stamp around it and then do another embossing here
So here is the final look. Look how pretty this looks now and what an amazing transformation to a simple notebook now it just feels more special um, and more personalized you can even emboss um, a name here and just have it as a beautiful gift a personalized notebook is always a good gift idea also so i really hope that you guys enjoy this quick and easy technique quick and easy tutorial and i hope that you apply it into your notebooks uh, let me know if you do so and i want to thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one